today, and today we're going to have a game of Mission Omega on the Commodore 64. Now, this is a game I used to have back in the day on the Amstrad CPC 464. Now, it was one of those games that I couldn't play properly. I didn't really know how to, but it was an interesting game. Right. F1 keyboard, F3 joystick, F5 analog joystick. Interesting. I didn't know you could get analog joysticks for the Commodore 64 actually. Learn something new every day. I don't know what the keys are. So we're just going to push F3. So we this is port 1, joystick port 1 if you if you're thinking about playing this game. Joystick port 1. Right. So we get a minute, no, we don't get a minute, we get an hour. As we can see, the t clock is ticking down. I think the story of it, I think you have to defuse a bomb, or there's a bomb going off. I think you've got to send out little robots to disarm it, or something like that. Could be completely wrong. Then you've got to launch, but you can only launch within that time period. Um, the music sounds completely different from the CPC version. The CPC version, the music was the theme from BMX Simulator by David Whittaker. It sounded a bit different, but it was that tune. Right, okay, so first things we got to do is build a robot. Or I think you can build up to eight robots. So down here is material left. So you're provided with 500 kilograms of material. So you've got to use it sparingly. So, right. So first things we've got to do is build a robot. So we go to base. Menu system is really weird. Um, so you hold down fire button, then you can choose. I did prefer how it worked on the CPC, to be honest with you. It seemed a lot more easier. So we can have a hover, spear, legs or track. Be still on the clock, remember that. But this is a review, so it doesn't matter. So we're just going to choose hover. So two count. So mass twenty kilogram capacity. Right. So we choose that, and we've got to choose a weapon for it. A small laser. We just have a small laser. Hang on. Small laser. Okay. I chose it, I don't know, fucking hell. Sensor, aerial, visual or infrared. Okay, we'll choose that. Power, so back. Excuse me, battery one, battery two. Or nuclear, we'll have battery one. Okay, so that's our first robot built. So let's choose, let's build another one. Hang on. So if we go, oh, so you can go to name. So you can name that robot. We we'll call it, I don't know, Mike. <laughs> Why not a Mike? Is the K? A oh, Mitt. All right. There we go, Mike the robot. Okay. So we got Mike. So let's build another one. So base now let's go for an all out here. So we'll have that one, we'll just have the best of everything. Missiles. Yep, yeah, we'll have that. Sensors. So infra fuck's sake. Infrared. Okay. Power. Nuclear. So Okay, so that's our other robot. So, quit name. I oh, will call this one, I don't know. <laughs> what should we call it? I don't know, let's call it Reg. <laughs> there we go, Reg the robot. 50, right, okay, so we got Mike and Reg. So, let's go to control right so we got Mike and Reg here so 
So if you go to the next, you can choose what one you want to control. Yeah. So right. So where you can right, what ones that's reg. So you can put that on auto. So auto right, what is it? Oh it goes through it. Okay. So that one's gonna do its server. The gra graphics are glitching up a bit. Let's get that all about. Right. So if we can go to next. Now that's doing its survey, so we can take control. Can program it to where it wants to go, sort of like um, big track. Um, so we're going to manual control this one. So you see these switches here. Fucking hell, that looks glitched. Is that supposed to switch? Not. Okay, so we just wander around. So these ba are just backgrounds. Right, so I need to find a switch for that one. I'm not liking the music on this version. Right, there's a switch. So that's what's supposed to happen. It still looks a bit glitched. Yes. Right, so... Hang on, what? Hang on a minute! I don't recall having problems like that with the CPC version. Right, so that one's deactivated. Oh, oh I think that's dead. I see what the fuck's going on here. That's shit. Right, they're both deactivated. So I need to find a switch for that one. So you can come up against other robots. Right, oh shit. Right, what we do, push down and fire. Hang on, so that gets us out of it. So what we need to do, if we push quit, then you can go to map, and that tells us where we've visited. So there's the one down there. So one, hang on a minute. So what robot is which then? You, on the, I'm sure on the CPC version it comes up with one and two. This one, what the fuck's going on? Hang on a minute. I don't know, this feels a bit different from the CPC version. Quit that, so we get out of that. Don't want to build nothing, so we go back to control. Right, so there's... Um, ah, I want to stop him, stop him. Go to manual control. I want manual control over him. Right. So here is a teleporter. So red... So they... When they flash different colours, they take you to different parts of the planet or the ship, I don't know, so... So if you just step right, blue. Right, let's go to the red. So you push... hang on. Well, that was crap. Red energy is running low. Oh, that's just shit, that is! Look, I still can't get through it! Ash, I don't like this version no way as much as the CPC. This is glitching. So, there's no other robots here. Right, do I have to switch? I think I'm going to have to shoot that. 
Yeah, there's something glitching going on here. Oh, that's just... Look at that! Hang on a minute. Right, that... No missiles left! No, oh, he's pretty fucked, man. No missiles left. So, I've gone round in a circle. There's, there's nothing to see here, I don't think. No, let's go back. Maybe go to another sector. Right, so... Go to the green sector, see where it takes me. Well, that's a bit different then. Is that taking me back? I don't know if I've gone right back. Look at that! Right, let's um, down the fire. See, so I quit out of that. Go to the map. Right. Right, so that's where I went before. So this is the greens. Right, so now I... Fuck's sake. Right, okay, so... Hang on a minute, that just takes me... That's the same map. We are, I'm not liking this one no way as much as the CPC. Alright, let's quit out of that. Right, let's go back to control. Let's go to auto on that one. See what happens. And let's go to next. And have manual control over this one. This one seems a bit faster. Ah, need to find a switch for that. 48 minutes till launch window, okay. Yeah, this music's annoying. Right, I need to find a fucking switch for that. See, the menu system on the CPC just seemed more superior than over this. A lot of fucking about with this one, right? It's nothing. It was just more simplified, right? It's nothing this way. I mean, graphics it all pretty much look the same. See, I haven't counted any robots yet. Reg has stopped. Enemy. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Right. Get out of this. Get out of this. I need to go to next. Oh, where is it then? Where the fuck is it? I want manual control. Right, where is it then? Right, I ain't got... Unless it's damaged, I can't move. But where the fuck's the road? Is it down the bottom there? It's a bit fucking shit. So, what's going on? So, I haven't got no control over that one. Perhaps it's damaged and it has to... Well, it's... No damage is coming up there. Energy's publishes out of energy. Now the energy's topping up. That might be it. But what, is that it down there? Right, let's go to next. See the other robot. Right, let's put this one on autopilot. 
Oh, it can't. For some reason, this won't work on autopilot. Okay, perhaps because I've got more shit stuff on it. Right, okay. Go on manual control. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah. Just going around in circles now. Fuck's sake. It's an interesting game, but the Commodore 64 version. I don't know, it's nowhere as good as the CPC version. I think it's down because of the way the menu system is. That was much more simplified, much more easier to navigate. And there's a bit of glitching going on here. I can't see any gameplays of this on YouTube. Well, for the Commodore 64 version. Right, I can't get through there. Yeah, this version ain't no way as good as the CPC version. Right, and I f where's all these switches then? Well, I've got through there no problem. Ah, damn it. Right, that switch is... Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, fuck it. That's why you have to... Re ah! There's a robot. Fuck it. Oh, no, I can't move. I can't move. Ah, it's blown up. That one's blown up. Right, can I can I manual have manual control over that one? Oh, now here we go. Oh, what's that? Right. So how do I pick things up then? I can't go to the next because that's the only robot I've got. Right, so you can build another robot if you want to, but I'm not going to. Let's go to control. Let's have a look at the map. So that's where I've visited. So where that red block is, is where I, my robot. Is. So uh, this was so much easier, so much easier to navigate. See, you see. Right, so that's where I'm at at the moment. So you can hold down your fire and push fire. So bits of the map you've explored you can see. All right, let's go to control. And let's go to manual control. Keys, is that register? I've got a key then. Now it says it's key there, but it says it's registered it, so okay. So it's fucking glitching. Oh, I can't shoot because I ain't got no missiles. Fuck. So at this point I'll probably have to build another robot. So what we're going to do... Go to quit. This is what happens if you try to launch. Disaster! You snivelling worm! We must have been mad 
to send you on this mission. You couldn't find your way out of a paper bag. You accomplished 4%, well that's all right, for, for a few, it's better than no percent. 4% mission potential. Yeah, basically, uh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm not that keen on the Commodore 64 version, to be honest with you. I just don't like the menu system. It's no way as good as the Amstrad CPC version. It just seemed more simplified. Um, there's glitching going on on this version. Um, sometimes it's a pain in the ass to get through where the beams are with the robot. Yeah, this version ain't no way as good. Mm, but it's an interesting game. I'll give it that. I like the idea of it. But it ain't that very good on the Commodore 64. Anyway, going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.